Tide Pods, Kanye, Yanni or Laurel. Here's the best and the worst of the internet from 2018. Buckle up. The internet's a confusing place. For every moth flocking blindly to a lamp, there's an equally painful hot take. Choosing just five was almost harder than the British government trying to figure out Brexit, but we did it. We love a meme here at MTV, but sometimes they should stay online. What I'm trying to say is, if Tide Pod memes go viral, as they did earlier this year, do not actually eat the Tide Pods as people did earlier this year. Remember when those Thai boys got stuck in a cave and Elon Musk flew over with a mini submarine to try and save them? And old Elon then tweeted that the guy who did save them was probably a pedophile and then he apparently got sued for defamation. What a ride. Speaking of the boys from Thailand, word is that Scarlett Johansson is going to play all 12 in her next film. Okay, not really, but that was the joke everyone was cracking on Twitter after backlash that she was cast to play a trans person. 2019 PSA, more casting trans people as trans people. Wait, sorry, I mean more casting trans people full stop. Kanye, Kanye, Kanye. Piers Morgan is, as Little Mix's Jesse put it, a silly <laughs> So it wasn't surprising when he tried to shame the girl band for their sexy outfits. Fortunately, he got called out by none other than Ariana Grande. Thank you! Next. And that's about it, apart from Trump nearly starting a nuclear war on Twitter. So when you start to tire of all these end of year lists, let's just be thankful we made it. See you in 2019. There can be a hundred memes on the internet and 99 don't have a moth and a lamp but you just need five to make a highly subjective list of all the best things on the internet. Let's go! Laurel. Laurel. It's Yanny, okay? We have had footballs coming home memes, royal wedding memes, doing surgery on a grape memes, personal favourite lamp and moth memes. Do they make any sense? No. Does it matter? Absolutely not. Yiddle, yiddle, yiddle. Look, we're not allowed to use the actual footage of Walmart Yodel Boy, but we stand a country legend. And the fact he later graced the Coachella stage because there's no better way to get famous these days than a viral video on Twitter. Like, share, and subscribe. I love lamp. You probably didn't expect Donald Trump's tweets to appear on any best of lists, but here they are. Courtesy of a Chrome plugin that turns all of them into scrawly kids crayon writing. Although in hindsight, that's a bit unfair on the children. It's rare that celebrities actually do Twitter well. Mostly it's just plugging detox teas and Jamila Jamil complaining about celebrities plugging detox teas. But Ariana is a rare pop star who actually gets Twitter. She chats with fans, teases music, and owns Piers Morgan. Thank you. Next. Yeah. Laurel. Still Yanny.